First at five, breaking news. Golf great Tiger Woods is in the hospital and undergoing surgery right now after a serious rollover crash in Rancho Palos Verdes, California. That crash happened early this morning. Emergency crews had to use the jaws of life to remove him from the wreckage. Let's get the very latest on this breaking story from CBS4 Sports anchor Jim Barry. Jim? Well, guys, Tiger's accident happened just after 7 a.m. West Coast time, and hours later, his condition is still unknown, although some reports have said the golfer is in serious condition. Woods' car went off the road about 40 miles south of Los Angeles. It rolled over before landing on its side about 20 feet off the road. The car, as you can see, was mangled with the front end destroyed and pieces of the vehicle strewn alongside. Woods had to be pried from the vehicle with the jaws of life. He was the only person inside the car, although Authorities tell are unsure what caused the accident, which is still being investigated at this hour. Woods was taken to a nearby hospital, and a short while later, his agent, Mark Steinberg, released a statement saying Woods was in surgery for multiple leg injuries. There has been no update on Woods' condition since. Woods was in California to talk golf on TV, not play it. He has been recovering from his fourth back operation. Tiger Woods, now 45 years old, remains the biggest name in golf. Prize money and endorsements have made him a billionaire. After a series of injuries and personal setbacks, it seemed his career might be over, but he proved otherwise by winning the Mattress in 2019, his 15th major title. Here's how one of his peers on the PGA Tour reacted to news of Tiger's accident. I mean, I'm sick to my stomach. Uh, you know, it hurts to see one of your, I mean, now my closest friends, um, you know, get in, a, in an accident. And, man, I just hope he's all right. Um, just, uh, just worry for his kids, you know, I'm sure they're struggling. Now, just yesterday, retired Heat star Dwayne Wade handed up with Woods at Rolling Hills Country Club in Southern California. Wade, joking that Tiger was giving him pointers on improving his golf game. Woods had spent the weekend out there as a guest at the Genesis Invitational, a PGA Tour event. Now, the PGA Tour has issued a statement saying that Tiger is in their prayers and will get his full support as he recovers. Should Tiger get back on his feet, the question might be whether or not this accident ends his brilliant golfing career. Guys. Jim, in fact, the uh, Masters is right around the corner. Was he looking forward to playing that? Well, he told Jim Nance of CBS Sports uh, just this weekend that he had his fingers crossed that he hoped that he could play, but he was very noncommittal because Tiger was trying to take it slow because he's been through this process before. As we know, he's had to take a lot of painkillers because of recurring back issues, and so he didn't want to rush it. So obviously that was before all of this happened. Now, who knows what his status might be? Well, a lot of people hoping and praying that he is okay. We'll yeah. be following it. Jim, thank you very much. And stay with CBS 4 News for the latest on the investigation it's Tiger Woods crash and the latest on his condition will bring you new information as we get it.